Sure, so all you need is to freeze a ripe banana and we also froze avocado and so this is our ice cream. So I microwaved the avocado until I was able to stick my fork through it, probably about 10 seconds and 10 to 12 seconds and then the bananas was 10 seconds in the microwave. From this point, before it melts really fast, I'm going to be using some Cara powder, and I'm also going to be using this Cara syrup. Yes, I'm almost finished though. And this is going to give it a chocolate flavor. Let's see. That looks so good. And we're gonna drizzle it with extra chocolate. It's gonna be so good. So I have one for the baby. And I'm going to drizzle a little bit more for her just because this is like really, really sweet. And there you go, you guys, avocado banana ice cream. And I'm going to just freeze the rest until the next time. Perfect morning breakfast for toddlers who are picky, for toddlers who don't like to don't eat that it. much. You have some sugar. And you can put sprinkles on it. You can add extra fruit. Mommy, and it's just the perfect mommy, combination. <laughs> yes. Anyway, you guys, I hope you enjoyed uh -huh. this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. This mm -hmm. is the first episode of my mm -hmm. banana and ice cream series. So if you like banana and ice cream, stay tuned because there's going to be tons of recipes. Anyway, you guys, toodles. Mmm, yummy. Good girl. No, no, no. That's chicken. And of course, you guys, don't forget that you can always store this ice cream in a container. You can even mix the carob syrup in and just leave it like that. So yeah, you guys. I hope you enjoy this video. Toodles.